So you guys might find this pretty surprising. I don't love doing YouTube videos. So I love the feeling of having gotten the videos done and I love being able to go back and be like, damn, that was a pretty good video and there was some good content. But this process is tiring for me. So how do you get yourself to do the stuff you don't want to do because you know it's gonna put you in a better place an hour from now or a year from now, AKA discipline? Well, in this video, I wanna share a recent technique I've been using more and more. It's a little bit corny, but it is definitely a head down and grind technique that you can use right away. What's up guys, Alex Hine, author of the book, Master the Day. Now, one of the best ways, obviously, to have more discipline is to first know what you're trying to achieve. So the first link in the description is for a free goal setting yearly planning worksheet. If you enter your email there, you're also gonna get an email every couple days on how to set and achieve some of your wildest goals. So check that out, the first link in the description. So I wanna introduce you guys to this head down and grind technique. When, look, at the end of the day, you have to get some crap done, you really don't wanna do it, and you just know you have to force yourself, either sooner or later. So the first step in this technique is that number one, you have to start with the list of what you need to just grind out and get done. Because if you're sitting in front of the TV, it's really hard to actually be like, all right, I'm gonna get it done when you're not even sure what you need to do. The second thing is you're gonna walk over and set a timer on your phone or in your living room or wherever away from your workstation for 40 minutes. The third thing is you're gonna say out loud that this is going to suck, but I just have to grind for 40 minutes. Then you can do whatever you want, all right? So it's you're telling your, your subconscious, this is gonna suck, I don't wanna do it, I'm just gonna force myself to be miserable for 40 minutes and then get it done. The fourth step is you're gonna clear everything off your desk. Throw it away, clear it, kick it, set it on fire. Whatever it takes to have a clean workstation for no distractions. The next step is that you're gonna grind. And it's really simple. All you do for the next 40 minutes is you grind. You wanna get distracted on your phone in the other room? No, you grind. You wanna go on Facebook and look at weird kitten pictures? No, you grind. That's it. And the important part is telling yourself, I don't wanna do this, but I have to do it. But for the next 40 minutes, it's just gonna suck. And after that, I can do whatever I want. So like I promised, it's really unsexy, but surprisingly, it works amazingly well. You know, I'm doing a doctoral program, medical program, seeing patients every week, running and growing my business, and trying to have a life outside of that. These videos take a lot of time and a lot of energy to shoot and script, and I'm tired every day. I don't wanna do it. So I use this head down and grind technique where the timer's going, I just slam it out, and then guess what? At the end of it, you realize it really wasn't as bad as you thought it would be. And then you can use that for other aspects and other goals of your life. All right, guys, so try that head down grind technique on one thing today. You realize it's not as bad as you think. And if you want to get started using this to kind of set and achieve some of your wildest goals, download the first link in the description, that free goal setting worksheet. You'll also get a goal setting series every couple days via email to help you know how to set goals, what to do to stake with them, and so on and so forth. So check that out. You can also check out my last related videos right there and right there.